in my jumper but never mind it'll do anyway I'm gonna go so see you a bit and I'm home oh my goodness it's been a day so it's just it's just been a day like honestly like today at work has been not great I've had like two mental breakdowns and started crying and all sorts. It's it's been great. I got I got moaned at quite nastily by one of the. Uh, I don't I don't even know her job role to be honest, but um, she got annoyed with me because she thought I wasn't doing my work, um, and thought I was just chatting, even though we were talking about. Um, so somebody like in my group they, they were asking questions about what to do about this case because it was quite serious and we were talking about it so I'd just gone back on to like the main screen um, so that everybody else could access all the cases and whatever um, but yeah this woman thought I was just not bothering to do any work I'm just chatting which kind of really annoyed me and it riled me and so I got really quite like killing with kindness and type it, it just got a bit like really and and like I was getting a bit like not snappy that's the wrong word but like I, I was given a bit of attitude but not I don't really know how to to describe it, but but yeah, it was just a bit a bit awkward. But everyone was stressed today. Everyone was mardy today. Like even the customers on the phone, everyone was mardy, and it was absolutely doing my head in. And it's been so draining. Like I've tried and tried and tried today just to keep a smile on my face and just keep going but at lunchtime after that I was just like I could so just like walk out right now <laughs> it's just not me the job is not me I don't like it I don't enjoy sitting around staring at a screen for night from nine till half past five every day I don't enjoy getting moaned at on down the phone and in the office and it's just I don't, I don't know what more to say but I just really hope that I find something for after panto because yeah just, yeah because this is only a temporary job anyway this is only going up until when I start panto and so I'd like to think that during Panto I'll be able to find myself a job ready for when I get back. But knowing my luck, I probably won't. So yeah. Um Yeah, so that that that's been a day anyway. And then Dom being Dom, he doesn't think about these things. He messaged me whilst I was at work saying ring me when you finish work and it genuinely bothered me because he'd not spoken to me all day because he'd been at work as well or he is at work and that was it and that was the only message I got from him and I just I had, they, we'd just had an announcement at work saying that Derby was pretty much flooded all over and all sorts and it, it was just like oh my god like what's happened and um, because we'd also found out the fact that there was a woman that was found dead in the river and and like had been dragged out and so it was just a bit like I'm scared you know and I should have been going to town with Zoe and her friends um but yeah, it 
didn't happen because I got back um, and uh, started walking up and Pentagon Island is flooded so I couldn't get anywhere I couldn't walk to town at all so I mean it took me like just under an hour to get back and it normally takes me 20 minutes at most even on like busy days so yeah <laughs> but yeah, um, I'm watching Sakani Journeys and it's Anna's birthday, so I'm just watching what they do. Anyway, so yeah, so I got back and it was just like everything just was like, and ugh, it's been a day. And I got back and I was like desperately, desperately trying to work out a way of being able to get to town because I just, I really wanted to go out and like spend time with Zoe and her friends and whatever, but I can't and I got, like, I'm basically stuck in the house. But now, because Don was saying the fact that Inti was shut. Um, but Zoe was in into, so I was getting really confused. But the show that he's supposed to be working has been cancelled and shut, etc., etc. But he's in town, so I don't know if he's actually going to be able to get back. So yeah, because the Derwent River has burst its banks into the city centre and has come as far as here. And that is pretty much it. So now so, go yeah. It's quite scary stuff, I'm not gonna lie. Um he should be finishing about now. So I'm kinda I'm waiting for a message to be like, oh I'm going home now kind of thing. But I've not had one yet, so I'm kind of getting a bit like, oh. I'm also hungry because I haven't eaten because I didn't know I'd dominate eaten, so I've not eaten. <laughs> also, my vlog's taking ages to upload because obviously everyone is on the internet now because, you know, everyone's stuck inside their houses. That would be lovely. Otherwise, it's not So that's fun. I'm loving life. It's just breathing. Look who's finally back. Mm -hmm. And we've finally eaten. Oh, yeah. Mm -hmm. I'm not sure if he's am I? Yeah.